The fact that we are now on part 18 and each of these videos is an hour plus long thereabouts isn't lost on me. Did I mention there's a lot of stuff in this game? Anyway, picking it up on the classic setting. And for my first trick, I'm going to be riding the stag. I'm not a freaking ma magician. Actually, I don't need. I don't even need to do any fancy editing. We can just ride the stag to the place. Okay. Not that much walking that needs to be done. That is because I'm going to distant village, and we're just gonna go here. So that bench that I wasn't going to sit in, or I didn't sit in, that I wasn't going to sit in for a while, we're going to sit in it. Right now. So, we're glued to the bench. Oh wow. I'm not sure what happened, but when I did, yeah, you can spam the attack button to get out of there. If you spam the move button, it's just going to wiggle. We are in the beast den. Okay, right. well, let's see. I don't even know what charm setup I have. I got a fast stream now, that's good. Oh, nest seal. You can dream out this guy. Rest. Hmm. There's a way up here, but let's check this place out. And an interesting thing is you can dream nail these two bodies. That's because they're corpse creepers in the making. Is it weird like hidden room here? Anyway. Get over here and uh I don't want to deal with that, so. There's a breaking floor that takes, that's basically a shortcut back to where you were tied up against your wheel. So, I'm not sure when they intended you to come here. This is a dreamer after all, you need dream nail. But, you can get up here if you have a double jump or come from above, you'll see later. Wasted a bit of soul, that's okay, that's a soul totem in here. Anyway, we'll go this way. The Mantis Claw accessible with uh, route. This is not a particularly long trick. Whatever. And yes, a shortcut with. Look second, just like two spiders in here. Or a rancid egg. Okay, well. Oh, 
Good old deepness. Breaking floors that drop you onto spikes. Although that's one of the further drops I've seen. Ooh. Surprisingly a real grub, and I'm pretty sure this is the last grub, so... Yeah, nice. Back down here. Oh! <laughs> well, it looks like I got pranked by the freaking spider. Deep Hunter. These enemies have names. I just don't know them. No, 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 no. Hey, uh, let's go down first, shall we? And into here. Another. I'm pretty sure one of these, uh,. Talking Devouts actually has a special Dream Nail dialogue. I don't want to get too close to any of these, so we're not going to see it. Look at this weird thing. Almost like some sort of machine, actually. Now, there's some off about it. If you cast a spell near it, so even Shade Soul, a seal comes up, and apparently the audio cuts out, I guess. The audio. I'm not sure why this game drops uh, its audio sometimes. I'm only like just now noticing it. Uh, coming back for the playthrough. Actually playing it again. And the audio drops. Oof. Yeah, there's a bench here. I don't want to respawn the enemies. And what does this hole take us? Ah. This is back here. This bench no longer works. And I really don't know what's up with these... Oh shoot, I didn't know... Cool. I didn't know you could like... Nice. Um, but yeah, um... I, I don't know what's... They like... Deep Hunters in disguise or something? Mm -hmm. those creatures were. I have no idea. Anyway, we went down, so let's go up, shall we? It is really easy for me to get lost in this place. Um... Wait, please. I kill you. There we go. Excellent. Ah, uh, yes. The dreamer. I think this is the biggest dreamer. Then again, Lurian wasn't that big. Not sure. Monomon was pretty big. Basically, shortcut. Okay, well. I guess we gotta do this. And once again, notice the time of day, so this is the brightest it has been. So it goes from basically dark to... I gotta let the music do its thing. But yeah, it goes from like, com not completely dark, but pretty dark to dawn to almost like day now, or almost like dusk, actually. Bound for brood for child. Fair bargain made. Give all. 
for her. I think that's all the dialogue again. My dream nail dialogue is horrible. Oh. Sorry, Hira. Looks like that's the last mask, uh, last, last, the last mask is gone and Hornet's here. What on earth is Hornet doing here? That's right, you hit a trigger, um, if you come here before going to Kingdom's Edge and fighting Hornet. Uh, she doesn't actually show up here, but she shows up here now that you have, uh, King's Brand. As a trigger that you, uh, you hit. So you've slain the beast, and you head towards that fated goal. I would not have obstructed this happening, but it caused me some pain to knowingly stand idle. What? You might think me stern, but I'm not completely cold. We do not choose our mothers for the circumstances into which we are born. Despite all the ills of this world, I'm thankful for the life she granted me. By the debt I owed, only in allowing her to pass and taking the burden of the future in her stead can I begin to repay it. Leave me now, ghost. Allow me a moment alone, for this bedchamber becomes forever a shrine. Er, before this bedchamber. Yep. So, Hera was Hornet's mom. Mother, forgive my inaction, but another path may be possible. Okay. I do believe that is it for the beast then. Even the stalking devouts respawn. Well, all but one I think. It was it was like PC somewhere. By NPC I mean enemy. So I will be leaving now. Welcome back to the fungal waste. I must tell you, I have a sports room on again. Yep, right here. There's a very particular reason I have it on. Into their thrall till ages pass and kingdoms fall. Eps and chills may fall to dust, but Mr. Mushroom readjusts. Mr. Mushroom? Who's Mr. Mushroom? Is this Mr. Mushroom? It's, you sound like a Mr. and you're a mushroom, so I take it you're Mr. Mushroom. <laughs> It's nice that you were able to help your friend. So you're not hungry anymore? Yes, that was quite the appetite. I was impressed. Still, we all move on sooner or later. The greater things, perhaps? So much can be achieved in just a short time. Oh, excuse me. Okay. 
Um. Pretty awkward, isn't it? Uh. So it's a tricking, talking mushroom. Nice. Welcome back to Kingdom's Edge. Why are we back at Kingdom's Edge? It's important for context, you know. Or rather, you see, this crack in the wall. Get it. Or something like that. Uh, I don't know. Right here. So you can even see like the mushroom particles. Uh, it's right over here. You have to jump though. Yep, and you need Spore Shroom to interact with this thing. It's weird too, because it's like a regular lower tablet, but it's like yellow. I missed this coming down here. We speak the path of the Master Herald. He who would signal an age's end. Spawn of self, their minds unite. Beside the source of acid light. A glow in darkest, winding depths. Winds all howl above fossil stone steps. Monarch flies in air set steel to roots domain and snail once shrill. Path of worm at new lands entered, their journeys in the kingdom ventured. Okay. Basically, this is telling you all Mr. Mushroom spawn points. I have the wiki. I don't know. I'm trying to figure out a. Uh, I like riddles in video games, particularly like, like ones lately, especially in MMOs, are like really cryptic. I, I I mean this one you can sort of you can you can understand it for sure, but I'm I'm lazy so Okay, yeah, right here. I'm pretty sure some of these areas I was like just Oh, there's a big empty space here and there's nothing here. It's like, yep, here's Mr. Mushroom. His dream now, though, like it's the same, by the way. Didn't trust the eye they gave you. Rely on your own instincts. You got a keen nose. Use it. And while you're hunting for secrets, beware those who are hunting you. Oh, excuse me. Mushroom gaming. I'm over here by Galleon's Graves. Graves. <laughs> I'm a native English speaker, by the way. This this is just sad. Anyway, Galleon's Grave. I've come to pay my respects. I've also come to hit this mushroom. The dead can't make use of wealth in any case. What would they spend it on? Yes, a big brood like that. They need food, and shelter, and toys. If you keep some for yourself, well, I think you deserve it. Yes. Oh, it, excuse me. And he gone. I'm just gonna like leave the room and do this. It's it's. it's. This is going to happen many times in the video. Oh, stag! We are at Mato's hut in Howling Cliffs. Yeah, this this mushroom really did just grow in here. Let's see. I'm not lying. Look. Seems kind of like something you find in a Discord channel in the in the meme chat. It's like this guy's just chilling in here with the mushroom, man. 
I was called a hero, and this moment may be called something very different after time has passed. The crimes and triumphs of our predecessors echo all around us, don't they? The chains of fate that bind us all together, do you really want to break them? Oh, excuse me. And since we're here, um, I didn't get all the dialogue from Meadow. Finello, bomb. The nail art, the dash slash, learned from my brother Oral, was it not? So he is still alive then. <laughs> I still haven't forgotten what he owes me, and I never will. Eh, I'm sorry. I shouldn't bother you with such things. I'm happy that you were able to train under another nail master and grow stronger, my pupil. That charm, could it be? Only the great nail sage himself could have bestowed such a thing. Your achievements humble my own, my pupil. I myself have sworn never I myself have sworn never to lay eyes on the nail sage again, not until I have truly mastered his teachings. But if you see him again, please let him know that I am forever grateful. Before you leave, rest and meditate with me for a while. Your company is always welcome. And not sure about that voice. Okay, that's enough. What's interesting is I, my, my eyes get drawn to whatever this, stop sitting down, <laughs> whatever this is in the background. It's like, bugs don't have skeletons, right? I'm actually curious now, so Google that. Do bugs have skeletons? Oh, stag! Alright, we're in Ancient Basin, heading towards Monarch Wings. Was it really that obvious? Well, if things are getting too dangerous down there, maybe it's time to take a break. Come back up and spend some time hunting, or gathering, or wandering aimlessly. No, not too much longer now. Oh, excuse me. Okay. I don't like this mushroom guy. You gotta grind that to him. <laughs> Crap. <laughs> I just realized, yeah, I wanted to start at the stag. Whatever. Um, we're in Queen Station. Looking for that mushroom, ah, well, I mean, sure, but... Realize there's an NPC I haven't, like, spoken to all game, even though it's the one you run into at pretty much the very start of the game, so... Show you how the banker works. Just you, Gio! Uh, yeah, I don't want to die and lose all my Gio, I'll just, uh, yeah, put my Gio here. Hey, right, cool. Geo Kalala. Yeah, you thought it was gonna be the mushroom, didn't you? Nope. Doing other treasure hunting. We're sort of in Queen's Gardens, but still in Fog Canyon. So, yeah, I mean, technically, I'm still looking for the mushroom. But reverse the shade gate. It's the mushroom. I haven't seen her, no. I'm sure you'll remember where you left her eventually. Trust the moon, or yourself, or trust her. You need to trust something, that's my point. Hmm? 
Church. No, not him. No, absolutely not. Oh, excuse me. And there he goes again. Did I dash through there without the shade dash being ready? And I just realized um, there's a few things I want to buy from Sly and Zelda. Ruining my freaking setup. <laughs> okay, fine. I'll hit the bench first. Okay guys, I just forgot. There's one thing I want to do. I need to buy something from Sly and Zelda. Oh my gosh, the banker is gone. Whoa, crazy. Yes, Millivel takes your freaking money and leaves. And the sign even falls down there at insult to injury. Huh, well that's no good. Okay guys, welcome to my let's play of Hollow Knight. Oh, what the heck is this mushroom doing? <laughs> yep, at the start of the game. I think this is like the fifth time we're here now. I'm not sure if I pointed it out, but the way he turns around is really weird. <laughs> like surreal. It's not by tools that you'll triumph, it's through your smarts, your speed, your determination. Oh, I see. So you've been following me around then. All my travels haven't confused your own, distracted you. Then again, a meandered journey still has meaning. It is, after all, from a journey we find a purpose. Though a stop is more than just a stop. And if those stops can't be lovely things, wouldn't you say? Ascendant plateaus, distant sandy lands, vast ancient kingdoms. Yours was not the first, nor will it be the last, but it's a unique and special thing nonetheless. Now, with my duties here finished, it's time I made a graceful departure. Okay. <laughs> Till next time, my friend. Tis a long road we tread, but a joyous one. Until our paths cross again. Yeah, that was horrible. <laughs> um, so fungal waste has mushrooms and acid. One of the mushrooms got up and started flying away. Yeah, that's just uh. Fantastic. Egg, I need. I am currently in the City of Tears. And I'm going to get destroyed by the upper class. As you can see. Don't you do it. Do it. Yeah, like I said, I need to get destroyed by the upper class. Um, what's this place again? Eh, yeah, sure. I want it. Go away. Stop. Wait, 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 wait. I need to recuperate my losses. You fine, sir. Um, this door takes a simple key. I will use the simple key and not go in there. Observe the grind set. I actually want to pay a visit to Eternal Emilitia. I don't know how you pronounce her name. 
Lady oh, Octocool? Hmm. Could it be? You returned at last. No, no. Oh, pardon me. For just a moment, I mistook a certain quality about you. You seemed almost... Regal. Silly, I know. It's clear that you're not of high birth, wandering all about dirty and tattered like... Isn't life just wonderful? So yeah, you hit a trigger when you pick up... King's brand. As far as she's concerned, you hit a trigger. New dialogue. I'll be leaving now. Ooh, okay. I need to pass you, sir. Yeah, and we'll go in this door I opened. Uh, Longstress Marissa, a voice to ease all burdens and still all troubled minds. I want to be kind of quick because this elevator is particularly annoying. There's a secret here, by the way. Wanderer's Journal. I'd... Okay, <laughs> this is random. Yeah, I don't want to ride the elevator up because it doesn't actually stop at these side rooms and it's a long elevator, kind of like a, a watcher's spire. Look, there's like some sort of portrait here, but you can't see it because of the friggin' stuff hanging here. Okay. Marissa. Monstrous Marissa. Oh, yeah, there's a secret here. Tastes wrong. Hungry. Have you boys been eating rancid eggs in here? But I think rancid is an adjective. Like, like I, I say it like it's some sort of creature. Like a creature is a rancid and it laid an egg. But I think it's just rancid egg. So I guess you've always been eating eggs. <laughs> Scroink. Wait, I don't think I'm supposed to pronounce that. You look pretty skinny. Very scrawny. That's the way to be, I reckon. Just look at me. A great, big, juicy, fat, fatty, oily, scrumptious book. No wonder I'm so popular around here. Uh, again, professional voice work. Professional uh, voice actor in the making. Something like that. Okay, yeah, sure, now we'll uh, ride the elevator. Be careful not to impale myself. I went all the way back down just to ride the elevator back up. It's a grind set, trust me. Okay. I don't want to look out the window. You know how like in the Queen's Gardens you can go to the window and it shifts the camera to the left so you can like see the Alubas flying around? Those freaking papers. Okay. Welcome to my stage, little one. I am Marissa, a songstress of some renown. Though, given the sorry state of this place, 
and they find it hard to believe. Huge crowds once flocked to hear me sing, and something changed. The audience, once so enwrapped, began to leave. I continued to sing, yet my voice fell silent upon their ears. Perhaps you'd care to listen to me sing? You'll be the first in an age to hear it. Yeah, we already listened to Marissa. So, an interesting thing is, I think she sings the vocals, like the choir, I'm not sure, I don't, I don't know, music terminology, but the City of Tears theme, you can hear it if you go, particularly on the two bridges and near the Hollow Knight statue. There's like a different version of all the songs in the game. And near the bridges and near the statue, you hear like the vocals kick in, like a different version of the song. Oh, just look at that, it's Millibel. Madam, you have my Geo. Oh, uh, hello again, uh, dearie. Fancy running into you here. <laughs> Is it your Geo you're after? Well, you see, it's, uh, it's a sad thing, but, uh, it's gone, all spent. The cost of running a bank can be high, so I had to charge a somewhat large service fee for your account. Perfectly le legitimate, of course. Just part of the whole banking deal. <laughs> you know. But, uh, thank you so much for visiting me. And run along now, won't you? If you allow me some privacy, I'll be here soon. I'll be done here soon. And you can have this fall to yourself. Come up, Ma. No hard feelings, okay? Yeah, the feeling is very hard. Wow, that's gonna get taken out of context. Alright. Millibill. No, nope, Millibill. Get off the bench. Millibill, you owe me some money. I intend to beat every penny out of you. This is gonna take a while. Especially if she keeps freaking. She's all empty. <laughs> that sounds horrible. <laughs> ah, I missed the dream nail dialogue. Anyway, there's a secret wall here. Nothing left, uh, yeah. I suppose uh, you might be on your way now then. <laughs> yes, I think that would be best. I think that voice quite does it, but whatever. Um. Okay, I forgot to mention, but Mr. Mushroom triggers when you destroy all the dreamers. And we're definitely back here for a reason. Where is here? Well, here is in Royal Waterways, basically in Dung Defenders, like, bedroom I guess, I don't know, this is a sick bedroom, I mean, wow this is your bedroom, this is so cool, another thing you trigger when you destroy all the dreamers is this. What is this place? 
This doesn't look like any other dreamland we've seen. And yes, I am running the sweat build. Yeah. Stop killing me, sir. Yeah, I'm not particularly good at this boss. Okay. My friends. I will protect our dear kingdom. Have faith in me. We will all meet again. I promise it. Uh, it might have all been a dream, but apparently the pain was real. <laughs> what the heck? So, Dung Defender, White Defender, I should say. Just like Grey Prince Zoke gets stronger and stronger every time you fight him. However, unlike Grey Prince Zoke, you don't fight a neutered version of him. So that's full White Defender. Isma. As in Isma's tier. Yeah, as you fight him, he basically deals more and more and more damage. Until he makes a dung statue out of you. Alright, well, uh, I want you to follow me into Forgotten Crossroads, or now Infected Crossroads. It's really cool how this room reacts to your uh, presence. This is a bench and this is a lower tablet. Vessel, though bound, you shall know the state of the world 
Oh, and this will be whole again. So yeah, this gives you something. <laughs> but it lets you view your game completion. Now, we'll say we're about to get an ending. It's not going to be the last ending, so yeah. There's, there's more to get after this. I'm going to get all but one ending. So you can see in the Hunter's Journal, you can see there's four things I didn't encounter yet. Which is interesting. And there's a few I didn't complete. Yeah, me see my completion down in bottom right. One hundred and two percent. Anyway, yes, this is the sweat build. I thought it was called the sealed vessel. Oh gosh, that was wrong. Oh, no, what are you doing? That's not it. That's his only attack that does heavy damage, by the way. Don't get cut. Apparently I'm horrible at dodging that. That doesn't bode well for me. Oops, well... Okay, Just, you're doing that again, stop it. Don't do it. Now he's trying to kill himself. Freaking Perry. Okay, I didn't know he had this attack. starts deteriorating now. That's actually what the tech is called by the way. Deteriorate. The game wants us to focus now.
Yeah, this game's long. One interesting thing is you do get menu themes and actually getting that ending unlocks new menu theme. So there's some that are always unlocked, like they're just free, I guess. Not free, but you know, you don't need to do anything to unlock them. Open on classic, but this is infected. This is pretty weird because this is the only ultra I'm um, gonna be doing mini screen. Yeah. But there are more endings to get. There's still more stuff in this game. <laughs> I'm not gonna get all of them. Well, all but one. I get all but one because I already got it before and I don't want to do it again. Yeah, I don't think there's too much to say here. So, till next time, see you around.